Thanks so much for coming out, supporting live jazz. We are B-Side Quartet, as you know, and uh, I want to introduce these fine gentlemen. First, tell you what we played. We started with United. That's a Wayne Shorter tune. Actually, it's kind of where he got his debut as a, as a arranger and a writer. It was featured on Art Blakey and the Jazz Messengers album in 1961, and from there he went on to crush it, as they say. It was just an you know, incredible start. So we, B-Side, if you haven't figured it out, we love to play tunes that not a lot of people play out. We try to find ones that you would like and that we would like and somewhere we can meet in the middle. So that's the concept. That second one was a, uh, a tune from Joe Henderson off page one in 1963 called Out of the Night. And whoever Scott Allison is of all music says it's a must listen CD top 15 of all time. So check it out, page one. So that's what we played for you, some 1960s hard bop. Who are we? Well, we're celebrating our 10th year anniversary playing together, believe it or not. Yeah, thank you. Oh, shucks, fellas. <laughs> not necessarily in this band, but rotating through a lot of bands throughout town throughout the years. So it's a real pleasure. On trombone, the one and only Andre Hayward. Now, if you don't know Andre, you should. I always say Hayward 2024. He's everywhere. He's got a big heart, a big soul. He plays with everyone. He's even got merch. Check this out. And, sorry, I couldn't wear it. It's too big. Andre's played, in all seriousness, with so many luminaries across the, the world, from the Duke Ellington Orchestra, the Marsalis Brothers, Jazz at Lincoln Center, and Chick Corea. So... Fortunate to have him in town, and I'm very fortunate to play with him. On guitar, Bruce Saunders. Bruce has also played with luminaries across the planet, and I, th I think, more importantly, he's educated thousands of guitar players at Berkeley and uh, UT Austin. So thank you, Bruce, for your efforts there. We all appreciate it. I know that can be thankless. On organ, we call him T-Bone. T-Bone, Terry Bonus. <laughs> Terry's a smart, smart cat. He could take that thing apart and, and, and tell you what it all means, but more importantly, he's a great musician. And uh, you might have caught him over the years, I think, I think most notably with Jazz Los Vatos, uh, with Ernie Duroa on drums, famous drummer. So that's one of Terry's groups, and he and I have had a musical partnership for a long time, and we arranged tunes together and so forth. And who am I? I'm Kevin Witt. I'm on drums. Hey, thank you. I like to call myself the bus driver. I just I bring everybody to the gig and hand out the charts and try to lay it down. You know, that's what the bus driver does. So that's us. For the folks listening on the live stream, thanks for tuning in. Don't be shy if you're so inclined. No pressure to tip uh, at Venmo at B-Side Jazz. You might see my name, Kevin Witt, at B-Side Jazz. For those that don't follow us, we're on Instagram, B-Side Jazz also. Go figure. All right, enough of me. We're going to play a tune. Uh, we're going to dedicate this to Chick Corea. Hope you enjoy. Sea Journey. Thank you. 
Thanks again. That was for Chick, Sea Journey. All right, we're going to slow it down a little, funkify it a little, do a John Schofield tune called A Go Go.
Give it up for T-Bone bonus on that one. Yeah. Beautiful. I'll, I'll come back in a minute and tell you about this one. Oh, 
Thanks so much. That's uh, called Mellow Mood, written by Jimmy Smith, but played like Lonnie Smith. In other words, very fast, uh, if you can't tell. Yeah, it was written in 1966 by Jimmy Smith. 
Uh, Wes Montgomery accompanied him on that, and it's on the adventures of Jimmy and Wes. Yeah, not Wes and Jimmy. Adventures of Jimmy and Wes, 1966. So see, we're building up to the decades here. We'll never get to uh, the 90s. Well, actually, we're about to. I take that back. Hold that thought. Uh, one more time for Andre Hayward on the trombone, please. <laughs> Professor Bruce Saunders. Bruce Saunders on the guitar. Terry Bonus playing that organ. Terry Bonus. I'm burning some calories. I'm Kevin Witt on drums. So this next suite of the two songs uh, are originals. The first one is a, an arrangement, and I'll go back to my comment about the 90s. It uh, combines two songs that inspired Terry and myself, one from Herbie Hancock and one from Nirvana. I'll let you see if you can find it. And then we'll go into an original uh, that Terry wrote, and I'll talk about that after we finish. Heart Shaped Maiden. Thank you. 
Bye. 
Thank you, Heart Shaped Maiden. If you didn't guess, it was Maiden Voyage with Heart Shaped Glass. Box, sorry. <laughs> it's only the seventh time I messed that up in public. Great. Um, we're going to continue with an original from Terry called Vicissitudes, and then uh, I'll talk a little more and we'll close it out. Thanks so much for the, th those of you listening. Please tip if you're so inclined at Venmo, at B Side Jazz, and for all of you that came out, Really, really appreciate you supporting live jazz. Thank you. Give it up for yourselves. It means a lot to us to, to look up and see you listening so intently, so thank you for that.
Give it up for Terry Bonus on that one. Andre Hayward. Thank you. That's the uh, first time we've ever played that, so I hope you enjoyed it. That's called Vicissitudes, and for you English geeks, that means the ups and downs of life, something like that. All right, we're going to close it out. So we're going to close it out. Uh, I want to thank Colin Shook for having us out at Monks. And give it up for Colin. If you haven't read about this guy, man, he's, he really saved jazz in Austin. I really believe that. And he's developed what a wonderful space. It has such New York vibes. And what's more important, his Austin vibes, right? So good job, Colin. Thanks again for having us. We, yeah, hey, thanks. We're B-Side Quartet. Follow us on the Instagrams and the Facebooks and all that. Uh, we'll be at... Uh, Batch on Maynard on April 10th, and then a concert there also April 21st, and then Elephant Room June 30th. So thanks for coming out. Come out again. Hope you enjoyed the show. Oh, we're gonna hand it over to Andre for a second. Okay. Hey guys, y'all doing all right? Yeah. All right. Thank you so much for being here. Just want to give a shout out. Uh, I just started. Uh, uh, joined the faculty at Houston Tillerson University a month ago, and my students are here. Stand up, guys. Stand up, y'all. These are jazz study students of Houston Tillerson. And also, I would like to acknowledge a longtime friend. I call her family and friend. Uh, just uh, uh, and a wonderful singer, by the way. We got to get her here. Her name is Song Williamson. Give her a hand and a hand. She's in the audience. We have a lot of great memories in the Houston area. Oh, man. We did so many gigs back in the 90s. Uh, so good to see her tonight. But OK, thank you. Thanks for coming. Well, you needn't Billy, original arrangement.
Well, you needn't, Billy. Thanks again. Give it up for Andre Hayward, trombone. Bruce Saunders, guitar. Terry Bonus, organ. Kevin Witt, drums. Thanks so much. We really appreciate you coming out. Be safe.